Hey, what is going on, guys? So you have a iPhone X or iPhone XR or XR or iPhone XS or XS Max. I'm going to show you how to access the AirDrop, okay? So where exactly is the AirDrop? You're probably trying to swipe up like this, the bottom uh, to the top, and nothing's happening. That's, what, that's how you did it with the older uh, iPhones. However, with these newer uh, phones, iPhone 10 and above, simply top right-hand side, slide down. Okay, and then the square right here, uh, the iPhone 10 and iPhone 10s, you have like a 3D touch. So if you do a force touch anywhere around here in a square, this will pop up. Okay, now I didn't say like tap it. Like for instance, you see the uh, Wi-Fi icon right there. If I just tap it, I'm turning it on, on and off. However, if I uh, do a force touch, press down hard, then this will pop up. Now for the iPhone uh, 10R here, it doesn't have um, 3D touch or force touch. So what you do is you just long press it. Just hold anywhere here in the square. doesn't matter. Just hold it. And then this will pop up. Okay. And let me bring this up. So we have airdrop right here. And you can, if you tap it, you know, you can put it on receiving off, contacts only, everyone, you know, on all of them. So this is basically a shortcut to get the airdrop. And if you want to turn it off, you just simply just turn receiving off. And then you can see when you go back into it, that the uh, it's not highlighted no more. Let me go and turn it back on. Now the thing is, you guys have to remember when you're using AirDrop, you have to have Wi-Fi and Bluetooth on on both of the phones. Now the Wi-Fi, it's not about the Wi-Fi network, so you don't have to be connected to any kind of like home Wi-Fi network or in your office or anything. It's just a it's just a Wi-Fi direct connection, so it has nothing to do with an actual Wi-Fi network. Now I know sometimes. Even if you um, don't have the Wi-Fi on, just the Bluetooth, it does work sometimes. But technically, you're supposed to have both on. So if you only have the Bluetooth on and you're not able to airdrop anything, then it's then go ahead and tap on the Wi-Fi and then the other phone should like show up. And I'll give you a quick demonstration here. So I have uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth on right here. Oh, but I have airplane mode on too. I need to turn that off. So I have uh, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth on here. And, wi and the Wi-Fi Bluetooth on here. So let me just transfer like a photo really fast here. I'll just go with this photo here. And how you do that is basically the bottom left-hand corner, tap on that little square there, and it's going to say airdrop there. Okay, now this just popped up both of them, uh, this phone and this phone. Anyways, I'll transfer it to both of these phones. They both have the Wi-Fi and the Bluetooth on. So give this a second, and we will get the uh, that photo on both of these phones. All right, let me go ahead and resend this one because I think I was in the uh, the lock screen. So I think it's this one here. Let's see if that's it. If it's not, it's, okay. Yeah, that's it, okay? So pretty simple. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.